don't rely on anybody like nobody young people out there be go-getters don't let what anyone else or what anyone thinks stop you from like doing anything you want to do make your children like know that they are the best like no matter what people say even if they decide they want to make videos or they like want to do something that is not the typical norm write it on a piece of paper write like why you're doing what you're doing all the benefits of what you're doing people go through things like you go through what you go through just take time for yourself i want to film this video so i'm going to film this video regardless Hi guys, hope you're all good, I hope you're all doing well. I have so much to talk to you guys about. Where I've been, what I've been doing, why I stopped filming. First time I'm actually doing like a chatting video with you guys, because normally I don't talk. I just say, oh hi guys, I'm doing a review for you guys. And that's about it. I never really like interact with you guys. I have been away for a bit. I'm just getting ready to go out. So I just thought, I'm getting ready to go. Out. I just do like, my face with you guys. I've had this hair in the same curl pattern for like a week now. I haven't curled my hair or anything. I think it looks okay. <laughs> uh, that is so weird. It just tells you how much I've changed. Like normally, I'd be like, even when my hair was done, I'd be like, no, nah, I can't go outside like that. I need to like redo my hair first. But now I'm just like, <laughs> ain't nobody got time for it. So I'm just gonna do my face and I'm just gonna talk to you guys and yeah i started youtube like a long time ago like i can't remember how many years it was i try not to look back on my old videos like i look at it and i'm just like i was so inconsistent when it came to filming and just like uploading content so i should have known from like the get-go like it was gonna be an issue in every video i did from the bottom of my heart i could say when i would say like i'll see you guys in my next video I would actually have like videos ready to upload and I would start like analysing and criticising like what I was doing. It basically just made me feel like what I was doing was shit. I already had like self doubt with what I was doing and that was like one of the reasons I wasn't consistent because in my head when I'm filming it I'll be like happy with what I was doing and then when I went back to like edit it I'll start analysing and just like creating self-doubt in my mind because I'm a quiet person I know people I I know of people but I don't know I'm just like a really quiet person for some strange reason and I've just always been been that way like I've always been like quiet because if you don't know I've got six sisters and two brothers growing up I was just like I don't need any friends they're my friends I don't need anyone else it's crazy to think like that now that I think about it. Why, why did I think like that? So I always created like a barrier for people and I would always think like why would anyone like want to be my friend? What do you see like? And because I didn't really have a lot of people around me. I was like very sheltered growing up. Very like, <laughs> very sheltered. I just chose to be like that. Like I was really like sheltered. Like I would not stay out late. I didn't really like going out clubbing. I, I was very like sheltered with like the stuff I would do. So when I started YouTube, I would get like positive comments and stuff like that. I didn't know like if people were actually being genuine because I didn't really have people around me supporting me when I first started YouTube. So when people were supportive, I didn't I didn't know how to take it. So, because I didn't know how to deal with it, it made me very like, maybe not believe in myself. It's so weird when other people believe in you, but you don't believe in what you're doing. And that was, that was basically it. I didn't believe in what I was doing. I knew I loved hair, I loved all that stuff, but I actually had no self-belief. It's so sad now that I think about it, because I don't think like, oh, I'm the best, like, hairstylist or I'm the best makeup artist or anything like that but I do believe that 
I can learn like I'm a quick learner like if you show me something when it comes to like hair or like makeup and stuff like that I can pick it up quickly and I love YouTube because it was like a platform to learn everyone was just learning from each other and stuff like that and I love that my family didn't even know I had a YouTube channel that's what's so bad never told them I never told them I was making a YouTube channel I told my my little sister she's 19 now but that was basically it because <laughs> I was just like um, I don't think they're gonna be very supportive in what I'm doing or what I was trying to do at that time when they did find out I would like expect my friends to be like happy if you are watching this. if you're watching this I hope you guys <laughs> they're probably thinking oh hey what you guys you're talking about me um, not in a negative way like they just didn't understand it I thought that like people around you should like support what you're doing but I come to find that it's not their dream it's not their that's not their goal that's not like what God has put in their heart yet they want to see you good I believe that your friends will always want to see you do good but really and truly that's not their job you're supposed to be your biggest cheerleader you're supposed to be the one that has the drive behind what you're doing I didn't have that so when I didn't have people on my back saying oh like my close friends or my family I would not film and when I would film I would like go and edit it I'll start criticizing myself <laughs> YouTube makes you criticize, like a platform, having a platform makes you criticize yourself so much. The stuff that you never like think twice about, you start to like think about it because you feel like people are like, people are gonna judge. I did that so much, yeah, <laughs> that that just made me be inconsistent. It made me be inconsistent because you start to overthink, you start to overanalyze, you start to create things in your mind that um, are not there I was like I wasn't being myself because I'm a quiet person by the same time I still have opinions about stuff and I would like want to make videos about different topics different subjects I would feel like oh who's gonna watch that who's gonna be interested in that if you're interested in something if you have a dream about something why does it matter like what other people think? This foundation is getting on my nerves. I would limit myself so when I wanted to make a video about me talking about something, i will be like, mm, yeah, who's gonna really watch that? Like, no one cares because they all they know you for is doing a certain thing. Like I put myself in a box, bro. And I don't even know why I did that. I think it's good that actually stop like making videos for a bit because it gave me time to like think it gave me time to like just look at myself and just look at like where i've been when it comes to like youtube and me and i think sometimes we all need to do it sometimes we all need to just take a step back and just look at ourselves and just be like are you actually happy with the person you're becoming and when I was making YouTube videos, I liked it, I enjoyed it. I wasn't like happy. I wasn't happy because at the end of the day, it wasn't me. I'm a quiet person really and truly, but at the end of the day, I do have opinions about like certain subjects. Sometimes I think completely different to people. The way my the way I think is I'm a very like open person. I am willing to listen to like anybody. I'm not like closed minded while being away. I've come to realize that with me, I think I am quick to react. Maybe can be having an argument, and rather than me just like basically stepping back and actually understanding what that person is, you don't listen to understand, you listen to reply. So I've come to realize that about myself, and I've been like basically working on being a better version of myself. I always think about my kids and stuff like that and one day I'm, I'm gonna have kids like amen oh one day I'm gonna have kids and I don't want them to see that kind of person around I don't want my kids to have that kind of person around them I want to listen like I want to hear to understand really and truly it just came to a stage where I just gave up I'm normally not that kind of person that normally just like gives up so when I started seeing that I'm making myself really unhappy, like I wasn't happy. 
it got to a stage where I just wasn't happy because I had like no self-belief, no self-confidence in what I was doing and I just thought, you know what, Ace is actually, you're shit, you're just shit. How can you have so much passion like in the beginning for something? Like I used to love YouTube, I really did. How could you have so much passion for something and you just basically, you turned your you turned your back on it so i just wanted to really speak to you guys about this because really and truly it's not that i gave up on youtube i just gave up on myself i put myself in a position that i started doubting what i was doing and that terrifies me because i only say in my life i don't want to start something and just like never finish it but doing that i've just come to realize i've come to learn so much about like myself and like what I expect from people and that's the thing how can you expect anything from people that don't have the same dream as you that's what it comes down to like I was expecting my friends to be like be on me like Ava why are you not filming why are you not doing blah 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 but I would have strangers imagine strangers messaging me people I've never met like my subscribers and stuff being the people saying Ava you're not filming you're not doing blah 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 people that don't even like know me or showing me like more support than the people I've got my friends. It makes me feel a bit like sad because maybe I'm just different. Maybe I'm just different. Like I'm the type of person that passion. You know, if somebody has, like, like, know, if somebody has, has a dream, passion and I, I see that they, they have a dream like doing the stuff that they used to do. I'm the sort of person that I would like message the person or I would call them and be like, you know, don't give up on your dreams. Don't give up like dreams, you know. I'm the one that's like different from them I guess I'm the one that likes like hair makeup beauty in general like spend like hours doing my hair and they'll be thinking to themselves Ava like what are you doing like why are you spending so much time I guess it's always good to have people who have like different a different layer to them compared to yourself because I believe that everyone is in your life for a reason and for a purpose I believe my friends are in my life for a reason but I do think it's good to have like support support in like what you're doing I don't know I feel like I can be myself more because I've actually like had like a little talk to myself about like what I'm doing and like my channel and me basically being myself and being like if people watch good if people don't watch good like I think I've grown up <laughs> so when I said I'm gonna come back on YouTube <laughs> the devil will always try to play with you like I don't know the devil is like the devil is so real he is so present and you have to like every day you have to fight against it you have to be like no like you know God is gonna win God you know because if you don't have that kind of mindset uh, the kind of setbacks you will have in life yeah let me tell you guys this story about me and trying to get back to youtube i'm gonna start filming videos i don't care like i want to start film like for myself i, I was like oh, i'm gonna start filming videos it doesn't like it doesn't matter just film like come film what comes into your heart Ava. i've got all my camera stuff ready all my like lights because like it's winter well spring is it off autumn Whatever season it is, it's dark outside, so I need my lights and stuff like that. Oh, there's a problem. A big one. I couldn't find none of my memory cards. Imagine. I used to have loads. I, can't, I couldn't find any. Nothing. Zero. Like, zero. I was, like, so pissed off. I was just like, what is happening here? I went out to buy some. Come back. And I film, like, all the videos. Like, I go back. I'm totally like for like 20 minutes of it I'm in focus for, like the rest of it I'm off focus I was like fuck this like this is a sign but I'm just like you know what I'm not gonna give up things happen just do it again I go onto the computer and then I was like I couldn't hear myself <laughs> okay I was like you know what it's fine like <laughs> it's fine I can do this when Wednesday comes, I'm like, yeah, I'm just gonna film this video. I think I was having something to drink, and the water just spilled all over like my MacBook. I was like, excuse me. You know when you're just like, 
I can't do this. I'm like, I can't do this like physically and mentally. Why is there so many things going wrong? Like when I want to do something, when I've actually put my mind to it and leave it for 98 hours. I was like, 98 hours, that's three days. If I leave it, I ain't got 48 hours to it. Me and Jenny. I don't have 98 hours to wait. Maybe 24 and a half, you know? Because I was like, I can't do it. Giving up here to me is like, is the easiest thing to do. It's something that I'm used to. Like, I, as soon as something like doesn't come out the way I want it to come out, I get this, I give up, blah, blah. I'm, I'm trying to have like a different approach. But you will just be patient. I filmed again. <laughs> and then, my basically um my external hard drive water power i was just like what is happening here like who 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 have i offended if i've offended you i am sorry like what have i done you're trying to do something and it just keeps going from bad to worse but i was just like you know what you know, i'm gonna film this video like it's in my heart it's in my heart I'm obsessed with things being perfect. Do you know how much that holds you back? You're looking for something that doesn't exist. I remember when people would try to do the wink eyeliner. And I would be obsessed with like getting it perfect. Like how this thing like it has to be perfect. I know some people might be looking at me and thinking to myself, you haven't made a video in a year, why are you back? Really and truly, I'm gonna say this to, like, to anyone that like thinks that. I'm gonna say, yeah, I'm aware I haven't been here. I'm aware I haven't filmed. But at the same time, it's like people go through stages in, in their life. And I just think this is a stage that I went through. And um, I don't know, I'm happy to be back. It's so easy for me to be like, you know, I haven't made videos in a year. And just be like, oh, forget this, and just sell my camera, um, get rid of all, all, all my lights, just get rid of all my equipment and stuff. Like, who's gonna watch your videos? Like, Ava, you haven't made a video in so long. And I was just like, you know what? <laughs> it doesn't matter. Like, it really doesn't matter. I wanna do this for myself. Like, I wanna make videos because it's something that makes me happy, it's something I enjoy. I'm aware that some of you might be thinking, you know, Ava, like, why are you back, like, you know? <laughs> and it's good, I like that, because really and truly, it means that I don't, I want people to see that just because you disappear or just because you go through something, doesn't mean like you can't come back. Like, I had to take time for myself, I had to analyze myself, I had to analyze what I was doing and why. okay to question what you're doing you don't all have it all together i can't speak for anybody but i really don't i'm still working on myself i'm still trying to be like a better version to all the people out there that have been doing this kind of video i'm talking and filming i respect you guys like salute you guys are, are the ogs like it is really hard But that's it. Um, I've missed you guys so much though. And as I said, I do want to apologize for not basically being consistent in like, not really and truly, there's no, there's no excuse for it because really and truly, everybody goes through stuff. But I do want to apologize and just say sorry, like, sorry to everyone because I know like, I've not, I have not been proud of myself and you know, my work ethic when it comes to YouTube so I do apologize about that to every single one of you guys but yeah just thought I would 
do this video because it was in my heart like some things are just in your heart and I just wanted to put it out there so that's it really <laughs> and um, anyone that is going through like a hard time or wants to message me about anything you're more than welcome to leave like a comment below in the info bar and or leave a comment inbox me send me an email like and yeah i just want to thank you guys for watching and i would definitely see you guys in my next video bye <laughs>